our, uh, our approach is uh, to uh, eradicate uh, the illegal cultivation uh, of marijuana on the island. The, its effects, the people of Kandavu will tell you themselves. And the effects on, of that uh, into the other uh, main populated, uh, populated areas of Fiji is well known and well documented. It is something illegal and we will continue to fight against it. That's what we are here for. And we expect them to, uh, to counter the measures that we put in place to. I will not be able to divulge all that information to, to you uh, because we, we are trying to, uh, to outdo them as well. So when we first employed the drones, we knew that sooner or later, because of the amount of money that's involved, drone jammers would be an option for them to come in to counter that. And we are already working too on countermeasures uh, to deal with, with that. We have bigger drones, we have other measures that we are already discussing now with the Ministry of Environment and Government, where we, uh, we employ other methods of uh, just destroying the, the, the drugs through spring and probably will kill out the, um, uh, the seedlings as well that could uh, germinate from the seeds that, that fall, similar to what New Zealand is doing. We learned that from the New Zealand police, and that's what we are working on now in acquiring the, um, uh, the platform for spraying and also uh, working with the Ministry of Environment. The New Zealanders have gone through that, uh, that process that we don't want to damage the environment in any way so that it's a, it's a safe way to deal with uh, that ever-increasing uh, problem. You know the, the fertility of land in Fiji, and it's not only about Kandabu, there's other areas up in the Novosa area, uh, in Bunolevo, in the, the, those areas up there. Uh, it's quite widespread, and for us to continue to use manpower to physically go out mm -hmm. and continuously to uh, continuously use drones um, it, it won't be as effective uh, as reviewing uh, our current operations and changing the way we do things. We certainly have to lift it up another level. Uh, what we've seen on Kandabu, especially during, uh, uh, during operations now, for about two months we were uprooting almost on a daily basis, and that's worrying. The, the amount that has been uprooted and the monetary value that goes with that is alarming. And there's other parts of Fiji. It's not only about Kandava. There's other parts of Fiji that we are uh, that we are working on as well. And that fight will continue. We are not going to give up on that.